Let's see. I don't see any concrete. I took all the motors. Let me get some concrete. I need to drop some ammo off. Well, I tell you what, once I'm done with this, I'll put it this way. Once I'm done with uh, space exploration. Oh, okay, hold on. This is becoming a problem. Let me go fix this. Eh, put all my ammo away. Let me get my ammo, and then we'll go fix that. Oh, interesting. But that way you would start in space, right? Like, there's no other way around it. The space exploration, obviously, you don't start in space, so... I wonder how that would work. Might just add extra ammo to these. What are these guys looking at? Okay, let me say, let's say 20, 20 magazines. Well, if, if I fail this one for whatever reason, I might also take into consideration a different mod pack for the next run. But we'll see, we'll, we'll see what that gives us. No promises on that front, but I will look into it. That's what I will promise. Um, what is that? It's nine. 900, so I also need a little bit more big motors. It's I think, if anything, what I've been, like I said, been really looking at right now is the C block, and I'm kind of leaning towards maybe doing that one first. Even that one's kind of a maybe. Yeah, I am too. Like I said, the last time was just my own idiocy whenever it comes to not preparing for the biter attacks and losing all my power because I I was doing something else and not paying attention and yeah. It's just what happens though. The only problem with this area, yeah, that's that'd be broken. They at least have ammo though. So what I might do What am I missing? Oh, okay, so I need defenders. Might upgrade the projectiles after all that's over. I think that'll help a little bit. I do need to upgrade the walls. I mean, right now we're at a one wall thick perimeter and that's just asking for problems. So that might be something we need to do as well. All right, let's get satellites. Let's see, advanced. Oh, I need low density. Right, so okay, let's do this as low density then. Solar accumulator's done. Um, let me do low density and then rocket fuel and then we'll work on pushing out the west wall because I don't think I need rocket control units for this, do I? I do. Well, I might work that as well, so. If the walls will last, we'll, we'll play it by ear, see what happens. If we start getting just attacked non-stop, then we may have to change up our plans here, but this'll, this'll go for now. All right, so steel and copper, which we're still really short on, but We'll go from here. Hey, have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. I might be here when you get back. You never know. Plastic. Let's put plastic. I might want copper and plastic on the inner belt and steel on the outer belt. like that and we'll say plastic and copper if I can get copper over there without too much of a headache now if 
I do it anywhere, I need to go from north. Technically, low density structures is a go. Need more than that, though. We'll say at least four of these. And I might productivity module these. Yep. Do that. I think I can either of those, no, but you can do uh, these, like that. I mean, reduces our pollution, reduces our power usage. Mostly the pollution is the problem right now. Oh my god, robots, hurry up. Speed! Uh, get rid of those light. All right, so low density structures are a go. Let's do this. We'll say low dense. Even though they're really not being created right now, I gotta solve the other issues, but right now that works. Um, 200. Okay, uh, rocket control units are basically gonna be the same thing. Okay, so let's just do a copy and paste. Like so. Actually, let's... Yeah, I just want to be cable length for the power cables. So that is exactly what this is. And this is going to be... Percy use. So I need equal amounts of everything. Glass, iron, red, and batteries. I actually just copy this whole thing. Okay, so I need red circuits. glass and iron is pretty easy to put together. It's not going to be easy to get here because of all the other things I've got going here, but Glass. Oh, 
messed up the battery line. Dang it. Okay. There it was. Oh. I've hit the wrong button. There we go. Okay, so that is all four products needed for the RCUs. Let's go ahead and update this. Which these are these stack to ten, so I'm just gonna say a hundred. I don't think I'll ever need these in my pockets, but you never know. Okay, so those are technically done. Low density is technically done. Rocket control units, pretty much done. Now I need rocket fuel. That's pretty much it. And of course, rocket fuel. Probably use the light oil recipe, I think. Yeah, it's the easiest one. I don't really have hydrogen chloride or ammonia easily made, so yeah, this is pretty much it. So light oil, iron, and oxygen. So I need more, not more, I just need some condenser units. And I'm gonna need a lot of them, so let's just do that. Bring me 25. And I squunch this all into here like this. We'll say rocket fuel. Where is it? Wait a second. Oh, fuel refinery. Never mind. Never mind. Okay, we have fuel refineries. I uh, need eight of them. Down here with the oil. Oil productivity things. Here we go. Eight of them. That should be enough. I'm going to need one, I believe, for the rocket silo as well, but. I might say. Keep 10 on me. Okay, so. Rocket fuel, solid. And I need iron and light oil and an output. So let's do let's do iron on the bottom. We'll just kind of keep with this formula we've got down here. So say iron on the bottom. Maybe the output on top here. Since I'm gonna need so many pipes. This is kind of the way to do it. Do I want to do it this way? Do it this way. Light oil's right here. Well, it will be if I bring it up. So let's kind of do that as well. Right. Oops. Okay, so light oil will be this line. I think it's the second one, right? Yeah. Okay, so that'll fill that. And now we need a whole huge array of atmospheric condensers. So maybe I'll put them out here. I could put them down here.
like that, or maybe like this. Maybe like that. I kind of prefer the pole on the side where I can see everything, so let's just do that. I think I might end with that. I might even shove this over and just kind of have it out of the way. And kind of squinch it down a little bit. Right. set up and this is going to be this will be oxygen why are you giving me ah. I didn't get the one underground pipe I needed this probably is not going to be enough oxygen produced by these at all unfortunately but it'll be good now, I know I've got these so why I really kind of wish my robots would jump into action properly. Let's do that. Uh, we'll say oxygen condenser is going to be a speed modules because these things are slow. Do these not reach? They don't reach. Pod number two. That, so that. That should be a pod right there. Okay, that doesn't quite work like I want it to work, unfortunately. I seem to be missing pipes. covered actually still like this maybe like that I just need one extra tile for this line. <laughs> ah, okay. Dang it. Just, just not working like I want it to. Okay. I do like the look of this one though, so let's just kind of do that maybe. That may be what we should do. So we'll say incoming, outgoing. Just have to surround the piping with power poles. And lights, I guess. Plug it all in. Okay, so that's, again, not going to produce even close to what we need. Yeah, I mean, we're really shy on the... When it comes to 
oxygen. Can I maybe do a whole a whole other bank of these? Could fit it right here. Since they have power poles, it'll work. It'll Yeah. I just gotta plug it all in. Unfortunately, they do use quite a bit of power. I don't actually think they make any pollution. Surprisingly. I mean, I guess they are just condensing, so... Shouldn't be any pollution, I guess, but... Okay, so we need iron. Since some of these need to output properly. finish these, I guess. And there we go. Is that supposed to be copper and iron? It is. Wait. Copper and plastic. Okay. And these... These are running. Module these. That at least help a little bit. I'm out of modules. Let me go grab some more. And that's pretty much rocket fuel out of the way. Wait, oh, that's a lot of modules. Okay. 50 to 100 is plenty. I don't need any more than that. Get rid of all that sulfur. Maybe all this plastic. I don't have explosives on me. Okay. Of course, more automation cores. Because I always seem to have a whole bunch of those. Okay, uh, let's see. Where is my car? Right there. Pick up all that ammo. I think I have enough inserters and everything. Let's kind of maybe fix this wall up a little bit.
I don't want to put a lot of work into it because we're going to move it here in a little bit, but this will kind of help out a little bit, I think. Oh, you know what I need to say? I need to have cliff explosives brought to me, so let's kind of do that. Yeah, 20. Let's keep 20 of them. Uh, let's do... Chest. No ammo, like that. Uh, I don't think we're... Well, we are within the network. Okay, so that will get blown up. I'm not going to have any cliff explosives brought to me. So let's go do that real quick. Let's grab, grab a stack of cliff explosives. It does not use space licks. Okay. It might still be fun, though. Might be worth checking out. I've just heard a lot of uh, good things about the C block. That's kind of the only reason I brought that one up. I'll have to look into the SpaceX or the space block. I'm, again, I'm kind of guessing it's probably C block or something similar, and you know, just in space, right? That's what I would imagine it would be, at least. Looking into it though. What are you eating for dinner? If you don't mind me asking. Probably gonna make me hungry. I know that much. Okay, so let's go. Ch let's go set up real quick before we start doing any kind of wall bashing. Let's get this set up so we have piercing anti-material rifle rounds going and I can throw all these in here and I can tell my robots to not bring me a bunch and bring me 200 of these uh, let's turn you on and off again there we go spaghetti oh that sounds good I haven't had spaghetti in a while well enjoy Supposed to be like that? No. Oh. Whoops. Supposed to be there. There we go. Now it's got steel. Good. Probably could have just handmade a bunch of them. Well, don't forget the French bread or the garlic bread. Hopefully you got some meatballs in there. Nice bottle of red. Oh, I need to. I need to tell this. I want uh, piercing ammo. There we go. Get rid of the old ammo. There we go. All right, 16 will probably be good for a little while. I'll let it build up and go grab some more here in a little bit. Let's maybe take out a base. Uh, might want some more fuel on me. So let's tell the robots to say maybe 500. I don't know if I have any fuel in a system anywhere for it to bring me, but close enough. Okay. Okay. That one went pretty fast, which is what we wanted. Okay. Uh, let's. Fly! Fly! Man. 
Wish I could throw a grenade a little bit further. Alright, these are definitely the biggest problem bases, so getting rid of these will help just in itself. Associated trees. Okay, come, come and get me, guys. Oops. That's it for the worms and everything. Good. Okay, I still see some red up here. Oh, okay, it's just the little guys. Good. At least they won't be making a base now. Cool. One thing I didn't set up, I don't think, is putting the rocket fuel into a chest anywhere, so I'm not even going to do that. I need to set this. There we go. I think I have better grenades too, right? Or is it just shotgun? Okay. The better grenades, I think, are later. We're in a different research. Yeah, we're starting to get into yellow science. So we need to get the satellite launched here pretty quick. Let me also make sure the rocket fuel is put into a chest. That way I can grab some if I need. Yeah, it was not. It's not. In fact, it is going the wrong direction. Alright, we'll say rocket fuel. Same here. Really, I should upgrade these. I mean, these I don't want them taking too quickly because they will just make everything really slow. Still massively short on the oxygen. I could probably bottle some up, and if it ever needs it, it can use it. So let me do that too. That'll give it a kind of a burst ability. Not a big one because these don't hold a lot of oxygen, but. Compared to what is needed, I think we need a thousand ton a piece. Yeah, a thousand. So those are going to use quite a bit, but okay. So if that is saying it's got that much oxygen in it, why are these so empty? too slowly? Is that kind of what's going on? We've got a pumping speed of 1,700 out of 12,000. The pipes aren't even full, although these are full. So I wonder if there's some kind of weird 
transfer speed going on between these two tanks. Let me, let me make a better tank. Let me try that. So this one holds 200k. That might be the one to go for. Let me go ahead and make that. It's going to take a little bit. Uh, in the meantime... Let's just check on our resources. Looks like glass is struggling. Steel's been struggling, but... Yeah, so... We definitely have a slowdown. Oh, there's, that's, that's, there's one yellow belt right there. Okay. I also want imp input priority to be this yellow belt here. Yeah, we definitely don't have enough tr for true... Uh, two full red belts, but that might be why, because I never hooked this up. Can I turn that off? Oh yeah, they did not break anything, good. Okay, so this is kind of what I'm going to do here. Where are you going? Okay, I don't need that belt anymore. Let's just kind of resolve this problem. Like that. And then we need a red belt here. This one I can remove the priority and I need to hook this up down here. This is not under robot control, so it's going to get it finished. There we go. Okay, we're, we're definitely moving up here. I mean... Slowly but surely, right? Okay, that should be mostly two belts full. Yeah, it'll kind of be the iron problem. And, I mean, the steel problem won't be resolve but it'll at least be full going as fast as it possibly can uh, let's see. it's still a little bit short of on iron unfortunately these craft at the same speed however we can obviously module the electric ones That'd be what we need to do. I've been kind of stalling just a little bit to try to get a little bit further, but we might just be at the limit of what we need to do. That may not be fast enough. speed mode so let's just keep the productivity going yeah probably one speed module I bet would maybe work for that you can go get some speed modules Okay, we'll do two. That should almost 
me. That's going to be really close. But it's good enough. Okay, do we have any new bio... We should. Why? Oh, man, okay. It's the problem with not filtering your logistics chests. I think we, if I went and looked in our logistics chest over there, we'd probably have enough biomatter. So let me, let me do that. I just need 180 more or so. So. I thought I had thrown some in somewhere. Unless it actually put it in this chest over here, which is kind of unusual. Alright, so I only needed it in spurts of 200 because it's not useful otherwise. Okay. gonna take a little bit to clean all this up unfortunately uh, and I never did place satellite rocket silo but let's get this done real quick what? Maybe put the rocket silo down real quick and we're way too far. Probably get the satellite being built as well. Let's see, let's do no not you. Satellite. Even though I need radars for it, so let me let's put it maybe up here. be a little bit better I think okay and let me turn my robots off grab all this and get rid of it there we go. I should queue up base robots to do it and not my own personals. Okay, so. Alright, so if this is going to be uh, maybe make this the satellite, I guess. And then I could probably just do radars down here or something. I might just kind of do that, honestly. And we have all this on the bus, so that's really simple. We have all this available. So... Maybe do red circuits and glass. No. Oh. 
And then two belts up top. Let's see one there. That. You're gonna need two belts. You're pretty quick, so. And let's maybe put you down. Well, I want this to be into a chest. And I want this to say be cabled. Like what we did last time. So if there is a I want only one to be in this chest. So that should be enabled, it is. And then if we put the silo down. Uh, the output, let's see. Launching satellites. Okay, so the silo, I don't believe, actually has any special outputs. I believe that's only cargo rockets, correct? Only cargo rockets, yep. So, <clears throat> I want this to just basically put one in there. Yeah, so you can't even, you can't even cable this. So, I only want one in the chest, which that should do. And then it'll automatically throw one in here, if needed. Uh, what I need is the output chest to be restricted. Maybe do output chest, let's say a stack inserter. And that one needs to be cabled. No, this does not need to be cabled. What does need to be cabled is this guy to this chest and I want to say if it's full of telemetry data if I can find it there it is so if greater than was it 5,000? Less than 5,000. See, what does it stack to? What does telemetry data stack to? 50? So this won't hold 5,000. So I actually want to say maybe 4,000. Right? So there's 48 slots. Times 15, 2400. So I'll say 2000. That'll be all four of these rows. And now, if all four of these rows are full, it should not put a satellite in here. So it'll auto regulate that. And that's what I wanted. So, can we do that? Yes, we can. So we get extra stuff out of that. Uh, you're an end product. You don't, you don't get that, unfortunately. I can put a chest here for these radars, and I can cable it and say maybe just, I don't know, hold 10 of them. I mean, maybe 25? I mean, we don't need a whole bunch of them. cable it. Let's see. So I can just do this. Okay. Good. All right. So let's get red. Maybe red and glass right here, perhaps. 
You know these are going out to the bus, so let's kind of make that happen. That's full. This I'm probably going to just combine into one. We really need to fix the green circuits really before we do much else, unfortunately. going to get very far if we don't have solar panels that's for sure so we need to really kind of fix that Okay, so first of all, let's get these uh, motors, cores, bricks, and steel. I'm just going to do this for all of these because we're going to need them anyway. Oops. One and that one. Okay, so motors. Unfortunately, now I need motors and cores. is the question.
It definitely works for the bricks. I could just do a rib build, I guess. Logistics back on apparently. Okay. And the bricks. Let's use a substation, maybe. Let's do that. You still hooked up? Yep, good. I do not need those being made quickly, so I'm not going to worry about how fast that is. Uh, we can say inputs. I don't really think I need this made quickly either, but yeah, I'll be fine there. Okay, so red and... Load density. Where's my load density? Ah. There we go. So, four satellites. Might do like glass and red on one belt. junk in my inventory once more okay so maybe
works. You know what, these should actually go into one of these. Mainly because it's not needed for the rocket itself, so... Yeah, let's do that. Kind of a waste of what I already did, but... I think ultimately that's what we should do. Okay. A lot of rocket fuel on me. Don't need any of it. Get rid of this crusher. does this need that it doesn't glass and red circuits so yeah this will be glass and red circuits I think density maybe and shields Shields come in right here. So now I just need, see that's low density I meant. Now I just need rocket control units and fuel. Okay, so we pretty much have everything except for uh, solar panels. We've got rid of some of that junk. Okay, 
Okay. Uh, let's check for green circuits, right? Because you are needing red circuits, which need green circuits. And you need green circuits. Okay, but at least that is being produced. So, rocket. Um, yeah. And green circuits is a severe cover problem. Why? 